Regional airline Liat, which has a 10-day timeline before exhausting financial resources, is dependent on financial assistance from CARICOM governments to continue operations. Minister for Industry, Trade, Cooperatives and CARICOM Affairs, Oliver Joseph, confirmed the airline's financial status as he addressed members of the media at Tuesday's post-cabinet briefing. The decision to bail out Liat was taken at the cabinet level on Monday. The 45-year-old carrier, which has been in financial turmoil for some time, will receive the first tranche by March end. I am pleased to announce that Cabinet at its meeting on Monday took the decision to contribute to the operation of LIAT by the end of this month. As you would have heard in the news that LIAT said if they do not get contribution from governments, they will not be able to operate beyond 10 days. According to Minister Joseph, this decision to bail out the airline follows an agreement between CARICOM heads at the last intersessional meeting in St. Kitts where interregional travel was discussed. One of the decisions taken is for the airline to undergo some structural adjustments in order to access the funds and operate as a business. For Grenada, we have always maintained that we would like to see Liat continues to serve the people of the region. But in order to contribute resources, state resources to Liat, the airline must be restructured and operate in a way that ensures sustainability. So we will, as a government, make a cash contribution to Liat this month and going forward, we will pay Liat additional funds based on load factor. Liat's board, according to Minister Joseph, is also required to submit a formula to government for analysis. Other Caribbean countries are also expected to finance the airlines. The amount of money that we will contribute will be based on the information financial information submitted to us by Iliad Board of Directors, which we hope to receive very shortly, and that is why the decision of the Cabinet is that before the, by, by the end of the month, we will make a cash contribution. Because only contrib contributing, you know. They have the CARICOM decision call on all member states, right, to make the contribution, because it's a regional airline. Right, we're regional governments and the shareholders. So all governments uh, ask, and Grenada decided yesterday at the meeting that we must come forward and contribute. And we think that if we, with our contribution and all the other uh, member states contributing, Liat will be able to survive in the short term. And as I said, in the long term, we look at a plan where we can pay based on unload. Joseph says the construct of the board will be of businessmen and not politicians so as to avoid political interference. Christina John, GBN News.